Hello Fire Signs, Leo, Aries, and Sagittarius. Welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support in this reading. For those of you in separation right now, we are going to find out if there will be a reconciliation between you and your person. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it will not resonate with each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me. Will there be a chance of reconciliation between Fire Signs and your person in separation right now? Page of Cups in reverse at the bottom of the deck. So there's a lot of wait. There's a waiting game going on with the Seven of Pentacles. They could be waiting for you or you could be waiting for them. Um, the Empress here in reverse, although not... When I say someone, that means roles can be reversed between you two, okay? Empress in reverse feels like someone is not, you know, really nurturing this connection or giving anything to this connection, but just waiting and observing, right? Seven of Pentacles. So there's definitely a delay in a reconciliation between you and your person. It feels like this person, your person could be, or it could be you, just waiting and observing, just not doing anything, right? Six of Pentacles in reverse, another card that indicates that, you know, your person possibly is not doing anything right now, not invested, um, or not wanting to give to this connection at this moment and maybe this is you as well but the seven of pentacles it feels like they could be waiting for you to uh, reconcile to want to reconcile with them instead of them taking the actions to the, that action towards you to want to reconcile again it feels like maybe both of you are waiting for each other but not doing anything about it and two of cups here in reverse indicates a separation both of you maybe are not on the same page on something and we've got the hermit here it's crossing the empress here in reverse someone doesn't want to budge someone is like here or it could be both of you or one of you just like in this energy of like i'm not budging i'm still isolating myself from this person i still need time to reflect i still need time to be alone I need to observe, I need to see how things are going to pan out, or I'm just waiting. I'm waiting for this person to come out from their isolation. I'm waiting for this person to decide or to speak with me, right? And page of Wands here is in reverse. So, you know, when cards are in reverse, so many cards are in reverse here, these two pages are in reverse. Some of you could be dealing with like a fire sign, somebody like you are, Leo, Aries, Sag, could be Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, could be a Virgo, because we've got the Hermit here, Capricorn, Taurus, can be any sign. But I feel like these two cards in reverse can indicate uh, someone here, your person, and also could be both of you. It feels like it's both of you. Both of you are delaying this reconciliation delaying speaking with each other just waiting and observing and we've got the strength card here in reverse hmm. so <laughs> it feels like someone it's like a competition feels like who who is the strongest who is the strongest who can um hang in there the longest you know almost like who's gonna blink first it's like a staring game right um, I'm just waiting. I just want to wait and I just want to see. I don't want to be the first to reach out. I don't want to be the first to initiate this reconciliation. Again, it could be you or your person or both of you, okay? So we've got the Page of Swords here, sitting here in vice position. So, so it's definitely saying, yeah, if you don't want to reach out first, then don't, okay? Um... And Page of Swords is like a spying card as well. Maybe wait. Maybe wait. Wait for 
them to reconcile with you instead of you taking actions towards them. We're going to get a few of these um, romance angels oracles um, to see what other advice I can get from that oracle deck, okay? Five of Pentacles in reverse for me indicates someone is going to try and return, okay? Five Cups here in reverse also can indicate that someone is going to see, starting to see more positive, more positively in regards of this connection, in regards to reconciliation. It's not that, uh, I wouldn't say that it's like, yes, both of you are definitely going to reconcile. But I feel like it could slowly, it feels a bit slow because um, Seven of Pentacles here again with the Page of Swords, just like just keeping tabs on each other, just watching, waiting, but not doing anything about it. But slowly someone is going to come to their senses, going to come out from the hermit mode, starting to think more positively in regards of this, uh, to posit positively in regards of reconciliation. This is when someone is going to finally take some actions. But I have to be super honest. It's very, very, very slow. But I always give this advice to anybody, to my friends, or even during readings, um, that you don't wait for anybody, okay? Always just move forward. Um, obviously, if you're watching this video, you could be wondering if there could be a chance of you reconciling with your person. Maybe there's a little bit of a tiny little bit of hope there that maybe both of you could end up reconciling. But... I feel like um, for me personally, I just keep moving forward. I do my thing. And um, if my person comes back, they come back. And if I still love them or if, I, if they have changed, if things have changed, I don't know. We'll have to discuss first and then maybe we'll reconcile, maybe I'll accept it. But by the time they return and maybe I'm already on to some other things, maybe my headspace is somewhere else already and my heart is some with somebody else already then it's not going to happen so i always give this advice to just move forward do your thing um love yourself first put yourself first and when they do return they return and then you, you see what you want to do then okay but let's let's pull out a few of these oracles So many, I'll take it. Deception. Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. Okay, deception may not always mean lying, cheating. It could mean that, but it could also mean indicate somebody is lying to themselves, right? Release your ex. Told you. Release them. Uh, the time has come to clear your energy. It's time to release your ex and just keep moving forward. Passion. And we've got healing family issues. Let your friends help you. Playfulness. New love. I told you there is a new love. Did I tell you there's a, there's a new love? Yeah. Um, when you release your ex, move forward. There could be a new person coming in. Both of you might go on a holiday together. Or you might meet this person while you're holidaying. Both of you will be flirting with each other. Going to be very attracted to each other. There's a playfulness energy here. Um, perhaps both of you will meet each other while e either you're on a retreat, you are going on a holiday, or it could be um, during, it could be anywhere, anywhere where it's fun, that's what I'm getting here, where there's a lot of laughter, a lot of fun, dancing, perhaps. And for those of you currently going through um, separation right now, especially if you're dealing with someone who is very deceptive, I feel like Spirit's definitely saying to talk with your friends, or it could be family, somebody you trust, and perhaps that could help make you feel slightly better. Maybe they could give you some good advice, right? Ask for and accept support from others. Yep. Healing family issues passion for me this just indicates you needing to go through healing and recovery and then release your ex move forward there's a new love coming in who knows again if your person is taking way too long to want to reconcile and you also are not 100 percent sure if you want to reconcile with your person then i think best is to move forward and there's a new love here right time waits for nobody time is like the most how do you say 
the most valuable thing on earth is something that you we can never get back right so don't waste your time waiting for somebody because that's waiting a lot of waiting here seven of pentacles waiting for your ex or your person your ex could be waiting for you so if nobody is gonna budge what's gonna happen next right just move forward all right fire signs leo aries sagittarius this is your reading hope you resonated hope it has helped you in some way shape or form i'm gonna leave you with um my playlists um check them out if you want to one is from my second channel it's a travel vlog channel check it out if you want to the second playlist is from this channel it has all of the readings that i've done for you for the rest of the signs um, you can click on it bonus completion reading scroll the way down look for your sign it could be some other important messages for you over there and i'm open for personal readings if you'd like to book me my information is in the description box below for those of you who like to be notified every time when i post your videos don't forget to hit on the bell notification button take care bye